Hello everyone, I'm Chester44, also known as Fly, and welcome to this Let's Play of Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. Last episode was a really frustrating and long one that I'm probably going to end up splitting into two parts, wherein we ended up finally finding and effectively killing, uh, Shepard. No, not that Shepard. Not that one either. Um, with all that taken care of, our only task now is to actually find out, is to actually deal with the Japanese who are in charge here, I believe. Something like that. Do not kill anyone, contact the detained American officers, find who, out who gave the ISDF assault team their orders. That's all we got. We have no notes, we have no data, and we have the map. Got a bit to go through here, and it's going to be a fair bit of running back and forth. But we'll see what we can do. Also, I did a quick look up, and this may actually be the last, uh, the last mission. We're close to the end. I thought the last one was the last mission. Apparently, I was wrong. But yeah. Let's, uh, make our way through here. And see if we can get through. I don't know how long this will take. We'll do what we can. Guards. And there's a camera here. Obviously, the answer is to shoot out the light, otherwise I'll be seen. in here? Looks like this is a way up. Can try and shoot out these lights. Can't shoot out that one. in the wrong spot. Give me a moment. Sensitive. Right, so, gotta be more careful there. Oh, wrong button. There we go. Ah! There was a light right here. There we go. That's much better. Now the camera can't see. Be more careful, Fisher. This mission couldn't be more sensitive. Oh, wait. That light can see in the dark. Give me a moment. You know what? Let me take a look at the map here. Looks like that's the way I'm supposed to go in order to get in. But I still kind of want to speak to those people, see if they have anything interesting to say. There's one. There goes two. Ah, that turned out all the lights. Now he's gonna come over here and turn the lights on. What was that? I think I saw it too. I need to practice. 
Head over here. Don't let him see. Good. Stay in the darkness. Damn it! I mean, the idea will work. I can get it to work. Let me try shooting this one out first. No, not with that. There we go. Shoot this light out. Okay. Now for the next two. There. Things will remain quiet. Sorry about the boop. And now there's no light. No light whatsoever. Still gotta deal with that camera, but I can get by it. I know how. I just want to get these guys interrogated and see what I can learn from them. Turn that on. I wait for them to walk away. Gotcha. Shit. What was that? You saw nothing. You saw nothing. Excuse me, I need directions. What? Okay. Get I'm the good here guy who's right here to now. save the world. I, I thought I was the good guy. No, no, you're on the team with the super secret underground base. I'm the guy breaking <laughs> into the base. That makes me the good guy. Now tell me how I get in. There's a ladder in the electrical room. You can probably find a way in from there, into the bathroom. Hmm. Did you try the doorbell on the front door? <laughs> I mean, that is a way. Did you try the... Fort fortunately for you, not only did you give me good information, but I'm not allowed to kill anyone. So we got a whole bunch of lights out. There's a way in in the electrical room, I now know. Who killed the lights? Who killed the lights? Someone. Now I'm going to very carefully take you out. Once you reach the switch, I will grab you. And... gotcha. There we go. Now fortunately, your buddy has already told me the information I needed to know on just how I'm gonna get in. Gotta get to the electrical room. So, that is what I'm going to do. Thank you for the information. Well, not you specifically, but don't worry. Now, your buddy's all the way over there, but I don't have time to go and deal with him. To go and drop you off by him, so you'll be fine right here. Now. Everything dark here. I need to very carefully sneak by. Like... Okay, that worked. Had to be a little more careful, but I did it. All right, pretty sure there's not going to be anything of note over there. In fact, if I look at the map... Yeah, it's just the two rooms with only the one containing a ladder going up. All right, let's pick the lock. Oh, God, that's blinding.
And there we go. This will be our way up. Let me drop down a save so I don't have to go through that again. Okay, up the ladder we shall go. It looks like this is our way in. Alright, let's head in. Enter crawl space. Give me a moment. You know, honestly, that kind of makes sense. Because in the past, every time I found someone using the bathroom at the time, they basically stood there the entire time. It only makes sense that this time, uh, they actually finish. All right. Right in front of me. Well, he's actually washing one of his hands. Ah, damn it. I thought I'd get him. Oh, there's a mirror. God damn it. Just a sec. I do have one other idea of how I can grab him. Just give me a moment. Just gonna get forward. Right here. There we go. And there's no mirror in the bathroom here. And gotcha. Nice building. I'm gonna suggest they hire your designer to do some work on the Pentagon. What do you want? A news update. What's happening here tonight? <laughs> I know nothing! You probably know more than you think. Just talk. No! Some men have been moved around. Guarding inside. A captain was here earlier getting volunteers. Not sure what for. It's a little concerning. I should have stayed home. It was karaoke night. <laughs> I should have stayed home. Some suits and officials came in for an emergency meeting. Some suits and officials came in for an emergency meeting. All right, so there's got to be a dark split hey, somewhere around here that I can leave you. Oh, would you look at that. I think I know how I can grab this guy, and then I'll have a space to leave both of the bodies. I don't know who he was talking to. If anyone... Oh, probably someone up there. That makes sense. Okay. Gotcha! Nobody saw a thing. He didn't Fisher. even shout That's anything. Lambert, I... That's it, Fisher. Mission over. That was not how that was supposed to go. You know what? How about I just leave you right here? 
There we go. Now, see if I can quickly get in here. Defending the CIA building or something. What do you mean? Well, it's not like anybody would be crazy enough to bust in here. This is the easiest job in the world. Right. There we go. Gotcha. And you are going to be left right back here. This is a lot better than the last attempt. Okay, so we've got someone up there and someone down below. Let's see here. What have we got on this computer? Ah, security access. Let's see. Press room camera. Ooh, that's a little concerning. They do have guards and the like. Staggering numbers from Korean conflict. Independent estimates now place the possible number of North Korean casualties as high as 7,000 during four days of fighting. Come on, come on. Damn it. I think it's this one. Got it. LTL ammo is in. I'll show you our new ammo tonight, whenever you're ready. If I'm not in the storeroom, you can find me with the servers. Code's 1945. See you later. Uh-oh. Ah. Shit! Well, careful, crap. Fisher. Okay, I guess maybe I can't do a remote hack, but I can still grab this guy. Oh, I didn't want to enter a crawl space, although there is someone there who I need to grab. So there will be someone up there who will be able to see me, I guess. Oh, wait, is this what? That's what I hack. Okay, we got the press room camera, we got the numbers. And we've got that on the ammo. There's the guard who saw me. He walks over that way. Okay, but there's also a guard over here that I need to grab. Fortunately, I can do so fairly easily. And he's got a couple computers. We've got a camera. That camera is watching him. They can hack here. Legendary golfer dies at 99. Lawson Woodrow Burns, four-time World Golf Association champion, died yesterday of a heart attack. He was 99 years old. Gotcha. Now back out of view. And the camera sees nothing. Pretty sure there's nothing we need to go to over here. Let's just get around. I'll deposit you where the other guy is. Don't worry. You'll be fine. Okay. There is another guard up there who I will have to find and deal with. Somehow. Oh, there he is. I didn't see him. There we go. So 
there's a way in over there. Where is that guard? Hmm. Alright, let me take a look at the map here. So we've got... Okay, that just leads out back into here. Looks like the third floor is where I'm going to need to go, ultimately. Alright, ah, there's the guard. He's patrolling on the second floor. Let me see if I can get to him quickly enough. It's nice and dark here. What the... Shit. More light here than I'd like. That's the darkest area there is. Come on. I need you to stop and turn around. Nothing here. Never yeah. hurts to check. Not turning around. Okay, good. Gotcha. There we go. Okay, come on with me, buddy. I got a spot to leave you, right along with your friends. So I got a second floor to look in on, and a first floor to look in on. Though I don't think there's really much on the first floor. And yeah, there's an elevator, which I could take if I really wanted to, or was lazy, but I don't need to. You know, I have a feeling if I really wanted, I could probably climb this thing. But I'm pretty sure that there would be no point. I mean, what would even be up there? I don't think there's anything up there. Most likely. Alright, buddy. You're gonna be nice and knocked out right here. Have a good nap. Alright. Let me drop down a save quickly so I don't need to deal with this again. Alright, now, is there anything in this room? No. I can't actually get in this way. There's absolutely nothing there. Okay, fine. Second floor. Let's take a look at the second floor. Mr. John Pei, report to receiving. Mr. John Pei, to receiving. I don't think there's really anything over here aside from the elevator. Yeah, there's nothing. I don't know why he was walking over there. What about over here? No, nothing for us to get to, so we just gotta go right up to the third floor. Okay. Area over there. And right here. Let me take a look at the map again. Yes, so that's the conference room, which is where we need to get into. And I think I see a way to get in. That's how I get in. I do worry about those guards. That's a what? Oh, there's a whole bunch of guards over there. We're perfectly comfortable here. I'm not going to the bathroom. Okay, fine. We can hold it. We'll be right here. Yes. Well. I'm not going to be able to get in. I need to take the. Uh... Unless there's a guard who's coming the other direction. Shit! He saw me. Those guards are still waiting there. They're walking into something. Alright, let me try and get in. Ah! 
And that was the wrong thing to do. Okay, so you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. Next episode, we'll go up to the third floor and see what we can find and clear out up there. Hopefully some interesting information. But that'll be in the next episode. So until then, I am Chester44, also known as Fly. That is Sam Fisher. This has been a Let's Play of Splinter Cell Chaos Theory. And I shall see you all next time.